Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KG48, and welcome back to The Infected. Oh boy. Another freaking dirty, dirty infected. What are you doing? Is she going to attack? They haven't been attacking my walls. I'm not sure if that's a problem or not. Uh, now, there has been an update, and we're going to talk about the update, but I was playing before the update, and they weren't attacking my walls then either. So, not really sure what's up with that, but I'm going to go ahead and take her out. And uh, probably point that out to the developer. Anyway, <laughs> yeah, we've got a new update, guys. And, you know, it's a small update. It's like a point one update. But, man, it is a hell of an update. It is an absolute beast of an update. And what we have here is we have the ability to make spikes. Finally. Finally. Once the, uh, once the uh, enemy's allowed to attack your, you know, the walls again, or they're attacking properly, these things are going to be dope. Look at these things. All right, added wooden spike traps. Vambies will slowly die when caught upon them. All right, so that is awesome. But there's but there's more than that to the update. Animals will attack. Uh, animals will attack it like any other building section. Only Vambies will get caught on it. So animals will attack your spikes. Vambies will get caught on them. Uh, the building recipe is we just saw, and they've also changed so fences now snap together. And when I read that, oh man, fence snapping, I was like, oh man. That really sucks because, like, I just got done building all my fences. Now there's this awesome new fence snapping feature. Yeah, I don't know. I, I don't know how much I really like it just yet. I, I like where he's going with it, but I think he needs to do some work. And I'm going to point out to you why I think that. Um, it, it seems to snap into place fine if it's just going as the next fence. The thing is, I, I don't know if there's any way to get it to snap in once you've made a, an angle. Like, see, that won't. that's not snapping in as far as I can tell. Um, yeah, it'll only snap in going down that way. There's no way to do angles. And forget about, like, you know, uh, the kind of angles I did with this thing. I don't know what you would call that, like a 45 degree angle or something? Uh, yeah, forget about that. And it won't even do 90 degree angles. So, it's the first step. And I'm sure this will be addressed at some point. But, yeah, that's uh, the snapping into place. I love where he's going with it, but it's not quite there yet. Not quite there yet. And honestly, you could just snap into place and do the angles on your own. There's no reason you can't do that. So, it's, um, I like the direction it's going in. Now I have to decide which side. I'm not going to be able to do all the spikes today. Or maybe I will. I don't know. We'll see. But I'm trying to figure out what side I would like to do the spikes on. Um, I think what we need to do is we need to upgrade some of the fencing first. Because I know the uh, enemies are not attacking it yet. But I'm sure that will be fixed and fixed quickly. So why don't we come in here and, first of all, close... Eh, leave the door open for now. We're about to go right outside anyway. Alright, so let's go ahead and grab some sand. Grab some clay. Put it in here and mix it up. There we go. And then I will take all the stuff I have. And do I have the uh, upgrade hammer? I don't know if I do. I, I remember, I think it was the last thing I was doing. So, no, I got the axe. Okay. Well, the upgrade hammer should be in here. Uh, which one is it? <laughs> I think it's this one. Yeah, it's that one. Alright. So, I think I'm going to start putting the spikes right about here. There we go. Oh, that's a repair hammer, Cage. You need the build hammer. You know what's funny? I knew this was the repair hammer. I knew it, and it was still the wrong hammer. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Upgrade tool. That's what I need. Beautiful. Okay, well, now that we've got the right tool, things will probably go a little smoother. Okay, there we go. Alright, we need 12 cements for that. And we only have 10 cements. Okay, so... Yeah, alright. Alright, I think that'll work. Uh, oh, aren't we, aren't we supposed to be able to upgrade the wooden gate as well? No, he just... He just I, I could have swore there was an upgrade for the wooden gate. I know he upped the hit points to 400. Maybe there's not an upgrade for the wooden gate yet. It didn't show me an upgrade, so I'm assuming uh, there isn't one just yet. Okay. All right. So let's go ahead and grab some rope. Only four rope. I thought I had more rope down here. Can I make... Can I make... Mm, I don't think I can make rope in my inventory. I'm pretty sure I need a workbench for it. Yeah, that's what I thought. All right, cool. So let's come up here and let's make some rope. Let's grab some rope. We're going to need one rope for each spike. So we'll come in here and see how much rope uh, we have. Oh, we got a lot of rope. Okay. All right. I don't need to... Uh, 
I don't need to make any more rope. That'll be plenty of rope for this run. Great. Just wonderful. So let's get down here and let's spike it up. And uh, I think starting next video, guys, I'm going to turn on Horde Knights and leave them on. Um, although he's going to have to fix the, them not attacking the fences. Or there's really no point in turning Horde Knights on because they can't do anything anyway. All right. So there we go. Oh, I need sticks and logs. That's right. Sticks and logs. Um, I do have a lot of sticks over here. I, I was planning. I was doing some planning. Uh, yeah, we can hold as many sticks as we want because they are not very heavy. All right, let's grab this sucker. And yeah, this is pretty cool because it only takes one log, four sticks, and like one rope. So that is pretty freaking good. I might as well just put spikes around the whole thing. I wasn't planning on it, but there's no reason not to. Eventually, those, you know, enemies will be able to attack properly. And uh, I wouldn't be surprised if that was fixed tomorrow. As soon as I'm done recording here, I'm going to go let them know that the, um, the enemies are not attacking my fence. Okay. Here we go. Oh, I forgot this is one of those awesome games where the uh, ghost image stays up for you. Now, do I want to put it like this? Hmm, I don't know. See, they could probably get in the corner there. But it doesn't look like putting it over here is going to work too well. I don't really know how I want to do this. I think we could put this one right here. And then kind of... Uh, yeah, I don't really know how I want to do this. Alright, I got an idea. I know, I know how I want to do it. So we're going to do this. Come on. And we're just going to put one right in here. Just like that. And as close as we can. Like that. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. I think that's about the best we can do. Because otherwise, I think they could run in between these and attack right here. That might be a little bit too, like, technical for the zombies. Maybe, or the vambies, maybe they can't do it. But just in case. You know, these things are cheap enough. So it's not really that big of a deal. All right, let's get these things out of the way. Okay. What time is it? it? Seems like it's late. Oh god, it is. Gotta go to sleep. Gotta get a, a good night's sleep to fight the Vambies. All right, so there we go, and we do like that. All right. It doesn't quite feel right, but I think it's right enough. I think it's about the best I can do. All right. Now, um, yeah, this is going to be interesting. I, I guess they just, you know, I mean, eventually that thing's going to have like fencing around it. So, but for now, I wonder if we can move the spike traps once we place them down, you know, once they're built, uh, this one doesn't seem to be going down. Is it too close? Hold on. Oh, wow. They can't even be that close to each other. Oh, man. Okay, that's rough. Alright, I guess I'll just do the best I can. I was hoping to put one on each fence unit, but that's not going to work. Alright, there we go. And I can't fit one in there. Damn it! All right, so we're gonna have to we're gonna have to go from the other side to do this stupid rainy day, I'm trying to build here and freaking rain. All right, I think I've got something that. Oh, hold on. Oh boy. Oh boy. Actually, let's see if they can hurt me. Yes, they can. Okay. I was just making sure. Whoa! What the hell? Uh, now I can't move. Oh, what? What do they get you locked in it or something? Like, if they hit you once, they make it so you can't move. Oof. Oh, dude, she's getting hurt on the spikes. They're not even made yet. Oh, that's hilarious. <laughs> you don't even have to make the spikes. <laughs> oh, well, that's going to change. Another thing for me to let him know about. Okay, let me go ahead and take care of my injury. There we go. All right. Fair enough. I just wanted to make sure, because they, they, can't, they can't attack my walls. So I wanted to let them hurt me, see if they can attack me, you know? All right, well, let's go ahead and build. There we go. And come on. 
All right, sticks for days. I got lots of sticks, man. Now that he, ever since he let you turn that turn firewood into sticks, it's been just awesome. Okay. All right. There. There. Right, you're looking good. You're looking good. Okay. You know what's funny? It actually is more of a pain in the butt to place down the ghost images than to get the items to build these now. That's hilarious. Okay, we need some more sticks. We also need to come in here and check our cement mixer. Alright, we gotta keep this thing going. We need to get some more clay. Clay all day. Alright, now why don't we take this and this. And let's upgrade this. And this. Beautiful. Alright, cool. Get some upgrading done, people. That's what I'm talking about. It's gonna take a while, but... You know, we've got a lot of it done already, thank God. Alright, so let's get some more sticks. Gonna empty this thing out. How are we doing on rope? Oh, we got plenty of rope. Plenty of rope. Just enough rope to hang ourselves. <laughs> it's pretty late here, guys. I am doing a video. Let me check my phone. I'm doing a video at 10.15 p.m. Night time. Alright, that is just way too freaking late for me. The update just came out. I want to get something up for tomorrow. The developer was kind enough to let me know when it was coming out. So, I'm staying up and doing a video. But I'm um, going to be a little bit loopy. Because, uh, you know, and it's not just because I'm old. Although I am. Uh, I've been getting up at 3 o'clock in the morning to, like, bake bagels for uh, a couple decades. I've been at my job for 26 years. So, yeah, I've been pretty much my early 20s. I started, you know... Just getting used to the whole getting up early thing. And then I started preferring it. Because, you know, when you get up early, or you go to you go to work early, but then you get home early, and then you got like your whole day to yourself. It's awesome. It feels like cheating. It feels like you're cheating at life. Just awesome. Alright, now let's let's use our awesome axe. I love this freaking axe. What is it? Five hits now? Three. Four. Oh, four. That's right. Four hits. Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Anything that only takes one log, I'm on board with. Developer, make everything take one log. <laughs> everything. Oh, man. The whole one log thing is just dope. Okay. There we go. Stop yawning, Cage. I know you're tired. But we got a major update here. I'm waiting for log spikes forever. So... It is what it is. Okay. And they, they look pretty good. They look um they look handmade. Like they're not like perfectly straight. I really dig the fact that they're kind of like awkward looking. It's very cool. A very cool design. I like that a lot. It really does look handmade. In a good and a bad way, I guess. Depending on how you look at it. Okay. Well. Let's get these down and across the way. Get this thing finished up. Oh my god, this is freaking dope. Okay. Alright, so we got a guy here. Hey! Hey! Hey, yo! Hey, I'm building here! There he goes. Alright, is, is it gonna kill him? It's, it's hitting his junk. Dude, there's a spike in your nutsack, bro. Is it gonna kill him? Or just kind of stop him. I don't know. Let's hang out. Too bad it didn't get him in the head. There he goes. Okay, cool. And I'm also going to see if the thing's taking damage. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and have one of our, our, our last set of rations. Well, I've got more saved up. Cool. Alright, I like it. Oh, and it does take damage. Okay, good. So they're not like OP as hell. They do take damage. Even though my walls don't. <laughs> Alright, I, I like that, man. I'm looking forward to Horde Night, guys. I am really looking forward to Horde Night. Um, can I repair them? From First of all, let's see what they take to repair. And then I'm going to see if I can repair them from the inside. Alright. No, it doesn't... Yeah, I can't do anything through the... The concrete fencing, it doesn't... Like, the concrete fencing will let me stab through it, but it doesn't let me interact with anything. Like, I can't even see the... 
I can't even I can't even see the um spikes. Oh, there we go. Oh crap, I should have saw what it. See if you put the spikes like kinda inside a little bit, then you can repair them. But only that one set of spikes. Okay, that's pretty cool. I wish I saw what it took. Oh well, I can always watch a video back or you guys can let me know in the comments. Alright. Yeah, the spikes are pretty dope. Pretty freaking dope. Alright, let's put some more down. I will show you how I put them down. Okay, so what I do is I make sure they're far enough away from the fence. So if they're red, it's not because of the fence. It's because they're close to the other spikes. Then I back them up till they're green. And then I, I kind of line them up a little bit. I want the pole here. I want the pole right here. Oops, I don't want to throw that. I want the pole right here to line up with the pole right here going this way. I didn't always do that. They're not all lined. Actually, they all pretty. Do actually, they all look. They all look lined up. Okay, maybe I did do it. I didn't do it on purpose though. I didn't think about it until I was halfway done uh, making this line of spikes. All right. So you, my friend, will be like so, and then you will go like this. Again, if you put them really close, then you can repair them from underneath, which is just uh, delightful. Okay, so there we go, just like that. And then we put another one right here. Okay. There we go. Very nice. Very nice. Honestly, placing them down is going to be the longest, the longest thing to do. Alright, there we go. Beautiful. Right, just to make sure they're as close as they can get. Got a little close there. There we go. Then I gotta line up properly with each piece of fence, which is not not perfect, but that's okay. Like I said, nothing's perfect. These are handmade stick fencing. It's okay if they're not perfectly set up. Well, they didn't quite line up perfectly the way I wanted them to, but they're you know. They'll get the job done. They'll get the job done. So let's go ahead and let's go ahead and make these bad boys. These bad mamma jammas. Alright, so there we go. And I guess I might as well do it like this. This is probably the quickest way. Yeah, definitely the quickest way. Boom, boom. And I, I can't express to you. Oh, I, you know what? When I was uh, putting down spikes on the opposite end, I heard a Vambi, and I couldn't find him for the life of me. And you know what happened? He got killed on the ghost image. Oh, that's hilarious. <laughs> get killed on the ghost image, you punk ass. That's what you get. That's what you get. Oh, you know what? I don't think I have to chop anything. I think I got a lot of wood over here from some prior choppings. I love the iron axe, dude. It's just... Honestly, the iron axe just makes chopping wood a pleasure. An absolute delight. It's so great. Four hits, bada bing, bada boom. Put it five minutes in, you got trees all over the place, logs everywhere. It's just wonderful. I have no stamina, so that's fun. By the way, it's fall. It's going to be winter soon. So, going to have to start worrying about, I don't know, stuff. Winter stuff, I guess. Maybe I might get cold. I might get a, a bit nipply, you know, out there. Okay, there we go. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Beautiful. There we go. Loving it. Oh, looks like we're out of something. Sticks. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. Oh, come on with the stamina, you freaking bum. Come on, Rocky, you bum. Fight this guy hard like you did last time. That was beautiful. But, but, my wife's in a coma. <laughs> Mick. <laughs> Alright. Uh, one more. Get a small tree. So we get exactly three. There we go. One, two, 
One, two, three. Okay, let's go get some sticks. All loaded up with sticks. Probably have to do one more run of sticks, but I think that'll probably be it. Maybe. Well, we will see. We shall see. Can these hurt me? No. Hmm. That's interesting. I thought for sure they'd be able to hurt me. Oh. <laughs> yeah, boy. How you like me now, Vambies? Kind of wish the ones in the back kind of worked a little bit better. But that's the best I could do for now. I mean, it's going to be effective. It just, you know, doesn't look as cool as the other side. But that's all right. What are you going to do? Okay, there we go. We are over halfway done. And honestly, putting down the ghost images is the, is the hardest thing. Or the most time-consuming thing. Alright, where are they? Oh, is that you? Nope, that is a sheep. So I heard that, Vambi. I just don't know where the hell they are. <laughs> it's funny. Like, I'm going to hear them, and then they're going to be getting killed. And then I'm not going to know where the hell they are. Alright, fair enough. I guess I'm not going to worry about it. Although, my curiosity... Let me just peek around the side here. Eh, nobody there. All right, well, fair enough. How about over here? Yep, there they are. <laughs> yes, sucker. These spikes are legit. These spikes are legit. Although, they will break pretty easily. So I'm thinking, you know, when you start getting like 15 Vambies in a horde, you might want to have like maybe a couple layers of them or I don't know. I do not know. We are gonna have to find out. Let me chop down this tray, make some spikes, get some get some work done. Okay. There we go. By the way, I put in a message to the developer, let him know that um, the Vambies were not attacking my fence. Uh, it could be something I'm missing. I, I don't see what that could possibly be, but it is late, and I will miss stuff. So I guess it's it's possible I am missing something. So obvious that it's painful for you guys, but I hope not. I don't want to call these guys pain. Okay. I'm really glad that the uh, fence doesn't the the, uh, the spike fence doesn't hurt me. I thought for sure it would. All right, what am I missing? Sticks, of course. So this is how I get sticks right now. Uh, I need something to drink. All right. Let's see how many sticks we can get out of a single felled tree. So you cut down the tree. You harvest that. Harvest. 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 Gonna be, I think it's going to be a lot of sticks. Harvest the firewood. Harvest. Wow. And it looks like it's going to be pretty, pretty painless, too. Oh, painless. Anybody know what that's from? Let me know in the comments if you know what that's from. All right, I did not want to do that. How do I drop stuff? <laughs> right click. It's like a different drop button in every game I play. Q, G, right mouse, like... It's crazy. It's a madhouse. A madhouse! What's that from? Man, I'm just uh, going crazy with the movie references today. All right, I think I'm gonna be one rope short, possibly. Let's just see what we have here. Nope, no rope short. I was no ropes short. Oh, it's beautiful. All right, let's take a look around. Hell yeah, zombies, vambies, you're, you're screwed, pal. You are screwed. We now have a full wall of spiked, what are they called, spike fence? Spikes, wall, spike, spike traps. Okay. Yeah, we got a full wall of spike traps. Oh, man. That is just awesome. All right, guys. Well, I love it. I love it. I'm seriously, seriously freaking excited about these traps. 
And um, I will be turning on Horde Night uh, starting next video. Uh, so, And I, I might even put it on like every night for a while. And maybe do a couple Horde Nights in a row. Uh, we will see how things shake out. Anyway, I am going to call this one here. If you end up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.